Hi, everyone, and welcome back to JSA TV and JSA Podcasts, where we're covering the latest stories, news, trends, and innovations from leaders across our industry. And one of those leaders joining me right now is NJFX leader uh, Felix Seda. Always nice to chat and always nice to catch up. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Always nice to chat with you as well. Yeah. I was trying to remember when was the last time we chatted. I'm sure it was recent, but uh, maybe a few months ago. Yeah, most likely. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so I know it's been a busy show. We're on day two. You literally just walked off of a panel yes. and straight into our, our booth here. Um, tell us about what you were chatting on the panel about. Yeah, it was the, uh, the keynote panel this morning. It was, and it was, uh, the topic was disruption. And yep. which is a pretty broad topic uh, covering our industry. Um, so we talked a little about, about the technological advancements uh, that disrupting our industry. Um, and one of, the, one of the topics that's near and dear to my heart is uh, obviously talent, right? Yeah. Um, and the, uh, the growth of, ta of talent and new talent in our industry yep. and retaining that talent. And uh, something that I've been working <laughs> Working on for for a, co a couple of years now is this uh, PTC Beyond initiative, right? Yeah. Um, with 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 a larger group. It's not just myself, um, but it's uh, it's a program focused on developing young leaders in our industry, right? Um, and it's I think it's very important. Uh, you know, the established veterans of our of our industry have done a great job pushing it forward, yeah, and getting it to where it's today, which is incredible. Um, but at a certain point, that is going to sort of shift, shift right? Yeah. People move on, people retire, and I think the idea of cultivating new upcoming uh, talent um, and getting them to assume leadership uh, positions is, is vital to keeping our industry uh, where it is today and pushing it forward. Yeah, it, it's so important, isn't it? I mean, you hear that in a lot of um, new markets, but new and old alike, right? The importance of, of building that talent pool, maintaining Absolutely. it and growing it to support your business. You guys have done a great job of that. You're, you've just celebrated seven years. Yeah. Is that yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, we just uh, celebrated seven years of our, of our facility being open um, yeah. back in September. Um, so it's been, a, it's been a crazy wild ride. Yeah. And, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's been a fun seven years. Yeah. And, and Looking forward to feels more. like longer actually. It does. Feels like it does. It's, it, you've been it does. It here feels, forever. It feels double that. But, yeah, I bet but it does yes. for you, yeah. especially. Yeah. yeah. Um, and and so talk about some of the the growth that's happened over that time. How your ecosystem's grown? Yeah, I mean, so when, when we started NJFX, we were originally meant to be a co-location facility, facility yeah. leveraging uh, the existing cable landing station that was there in in, in Wall, New Jersey. Yeah. Um, what we saw it is that new subsea developers and operators wanted to be in a carrier neutral environment, which is exactly what NJFX is. Yeah. Um, and so we've become our own cable landing station now um, with multiple subsea cables coming into our campus and potentially more. Yeah. And because of that, we're seeing a, a robust growth in our, in our ecosystem. Um, what was mainly really a place for wholesale uh, networks to integrate as a as a as a unique marketplace hub. Yeah. Um, now we're starting to see that shift a little bit, not just from the wholesale providers, but into obviously the OTT and content guys who are uh, owners on these subsea systems right. that are being developed, yeah. but also the enterprise as well. Right. They want to be owners of their own fate, and they're starting to look at unique models of interconnectivity, not just the traditional ways of tying back to their. Uh, to their existing data centers, but utilizing a place like NJFX as their main interconnectivity hub, where those te where those tentacles can kind of reach out across both uh, transatlantically and then terrestrially across the U.S. Yeah, an amazing just growth trajectory in terms of that whole ecosystem. It's yeah. been amazing to watch and and see the importance of of what you're doing grow. Um, but there's more to come. I know you have new products, I believe, rolling out. Is is that right? Anything you can share? Um, there's potentially new products that we're involved in. Yeah. Um, uh, like again, we're a, we're a cable landing station, so always looking at uh, development of, of infrastructure, um, and uh, you know we're excited to be part of that, right? As yeah. as new subsea cables come on board, um, and you know there's new products being talked about up, up across the U.S. Yeah. We're hoping to be uh, a part of that solution, and uh, and keeping our industry uh, going forward. Yeah. 
Great. Well, we I'm sure we'll be talking to you more. You the week's not over and what's next? You know, what are you, what do you have planned for the rest of this week? Uh, anything? Well, I've been here since Saturday. I got here, yeah. got, oh, got, yeah, here, okay. got here early and uh, nice. did a little, you know, just kind got of adjusted explore, to the time. Yeah, exploring and, and adjusting to the time and uh, you know, it's it's been it's been the usual busy, busy, busy. busy. Uh, yeah. Like I said, I just got off the uh, the keynote panel this morning. Yeah. And now just jumping into into meetings all day. And then tonight is the uh, the Carrier Awards dinner. That's right. Which is the uh, the black tie event, which is always pretty fun. That is. Um, yeah. And it gives us an opportunity to kind of you know, dress up and, uh, yeah. and be in a, in a nice, uh, fun environment. So I'm looking yeah. forward to that as well. Yeah, that's great. It's always a great event. Yeah. 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 Enjoy. And so for our viewers who may miss you this week, but want to connect in the future, how can they reach out? Uh, my email's pretty simple. Um, Felix at MJFX.net. Unless we get another Felix, that's not going to change. Yeah. <laughs> um, and obviously I'm on LinkedIn. Uh, so, you know, feel free to reach out. Happy, happy to, happy to connect. Great. Thanks so much for joining us. It was It's always great to make time to have a quick conversation with you. Absolutely, uh, absolutely. And uh, we look forward to more. Yeah, thank in the, you, thank in you the for future. having me. I appreciate of it. Of course, of course. And thank you, viewers, for tuning in again here to JSA TV and JSA Podcast. Stay tuned for more throughout the rest of day two here at Capacity Europe. Happy networking.